Hey beautiful people in the world, brothers, sisters in the world, how guys doing on me? ZJ, Shayna, SIA, and I'm back here on another video. <laughs> So we got to um, start on that. So right now I have my chicken here. Uh, I'm currently about to rest this out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck. oh my god. So what I'm about to do now is I'm about to season my chicken. And after I season it, um, we're gonna go ahead and get it. Ah! started in the pot and babe's trying to like fix me up or whatever so yeah let's get started all right y'all so here are all my seasonings and all the ingredients that i'm gonna need to cook um i have my chicken here it's actually unthawing because i just put another piece in there so i have the parmesan the garlic powder uh, the heavy whipping cream, Cajun, um, the salt, olive oil. I just got a little one because we don't really use that like that. Um, garlic, butter, and some chicken broth. And parsley was actually just my choice um, to just make the green little flakes instead of buying the actual green leaves for it. Um, and we have a little bit of pepper. So yeah, that's pretty much all the ingredients that I will be using. You guys can just go along with me while I make it. Oh, and of course we have flour to dip the um, chicken in. And I'm also gonna like add some seasoning salt to my chicken, just a little bit, because I know they do say this gets a little bit tasty, like, a little bit seasoned due to the like sauce and stuff like that but yes yeah, so I am gonna add a little bit of seasoning salt to it but I think that's it for my own twist for real so yeah y'all y'all just stay tuned all right y'all so now that I put my own twist to it oh my gosh Now that I have my own twist, I'm about to add it to the butter and the oil here. Huh. So y'all, I'm getting really interrupted right now, but I'm Ew! So right now I'm covering the chicken in flour. Like that. And then we're gonna drop this one in just as well. I'm gonna drop that thing on that, uh, on that skillet right there. But you wanna make sure it's fully covered for it. Now we're gonna put that one in. And y'all, it's really only supposed to be four tenders. But of course, somebody else added extra. So now we gotta try to make it do. Oh! Ew! Dude! So we can make it to do what it do. So I'm about to add this one. Oh. And then these last little nugs. And then we just wanna get them back. Now I gotta try to like it's make a big, all of them. It's fit. a big pot though, baby. Shut up. Let me show y'all how I look over here. Mm -hmm. And okay, so we're gonna let that um simmer. Cook and simmer for about four to five minutes. And then afterwards I'll come back to y'all when 
because it's only cooking for four to five minutes and then we make the sauce and stuff and then we put the chicken back in there so it won't overcook you get it so anyways i'll be back to y'all okay here you all right y'all so i've gotten really really far <laughs> this this meal it, it really doesn't take like very long to make honestly so we're just letting that simmer i'm about to get ready to add the parmesan cheese and then i'm gonna add a little bit of parsley and then um we'll just wait for this to thicken up and then this will be done and we're gonna go ahead and make some garlic toast and some instant mashed potatoes so we just go ahead and make these with it so we'll have some um creamy garlic chicken and garlic bread and mashed potatoes so yeah i'll be back to you okay but look y'all this is our food look good right right so yeah we are done and they tell me out a little bit but yeah so this is the end of this cooking video make sure y'all like comment and subscribe to my channel and if you're new make sure you like comment and subscribe <laughs> period bye good <laughs>